I, I think you know if I don't know the answer to something, I'm not sure. I just say it. I don't, know. <laughs> I don't don't have all the answers, and I think that's okay. And um, you know, when people ask, "Are you going to win the Olympics?" I always tell them, "We don't know." You know, yeah. we just say we try our best and we do the right things, but we never know. We've never known in the past. We'll never know in the future. So yeah. people ask me all the time, "You're confident you're going to turn this around?" Like I'm confident we'll do our best. It's no more complicated than that. I'm yeah, confident yeah. we'll do everything right and we'll be as good as we can be. But I mean, how confident have you, are you of winning? You know, even when you're the best team in the velodrome by um, a country mile. Yeah, I'm never 100 percent confident of winning. Yeah, yeah. It's, um, it's just a sliding scale. Mm. But you can always be 100 percent confident that you do your best. And um, yeah. yeah. That's all you can do, isn't it? You know, and, and I think that that's, that sets a realistic expectation. I think soon as soon people start going, we're going to win, we're going to win, we're going to win. Yeah. You're either going to win or you're going to be disappointed, aren't you? Yeah. Whereas we we'll do our best and, yeah. and you know control everything you possibly can and get there. And you know, if if if, if everybody's supporting and pulling in the right direction to that common goal, then you're yeah. setting yourself up for success. Even if you perform at your best and you don't win, yeah. that's a form of success. Yes. Yeah. It if is. If you're banging out PBs and you know and. No, you're right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely right, and it, 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 that is what success looks like, isn't it? You know, if you do everything right and you get to the start line, you get a silver medal or a bronze medal or fourth or whatever. I mean, how can it be anything else? I think enjoying it as well. Yeah, yeah. That's, and that's uh, that's that's probably you know the bits you've had the last couple of weeks is they. Yeah. When it's emotional and it's a negative emotion rather than a positive emotion. Yeah. The enjoyment goes away, doesn't it? And then you start. Yeah, like you wouldn't believe. Yeah. <laughs> like honestly, I yeah. Um, there's been times the last two weeks, I mean, I've literally, so I have my breakfast and I'm due to do a, a two or three hour ride. And I, I sort of walk down, I look in the garage, I look at my bike and I just, I, I just can't do it. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? You just walk away from it. It's like, ah. And it's, it's so different from when you, you know, you approach your bike in a positive frame of mind and it doesn't matter if you're going well or not, it's just having that positive frame of mind and like enjoying life, enjoying being alive and yeah. enjoying being a professional cyclist. You can almost like spring down to the garage in your kit, jump on it, crack up the garage door and off you go. And it, it almost feel like um, you have days where you're just totally bulletproof, um, you know, from a mental point of view. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You could have the best, you could be hitting PBs left, right and center, or you could just be crawling along and um, you could enjoy the fact that you're out on a bike and not sat in an office. And um, I, I guess, yeah, I mean, real success is having that every time you go out to do your job or ride.